Um, you mentioned uh, Noel earlier. Yeah. W what's the situation between you two? The situation now? is still the same. He's off doing his cosmic pop. And I'm here doing my thing and uh, giving the people what they want. And that's what life's about. That's what life's always been about, as far as I'm concerned. You know what I mean? Giving the kids what they want. And if you can do that and you get what you want out of it, then that's, to me, he's like, Nirvana, isn't it? It's great. I mean, you, what, what would you make of his record? Have you, have you sat no, down with I've it a heard, lot? No, I've not sat down with it. No, God, no. I've heard it. I've heard like what I've heard. I, I just don't... And like, obviously people are going to say, you know, I'm digging him out. I'm not. I prefer his first two other ones. I like... I like his formula, you know what I mean? Like, you know, the songs, you know. And all this... I, don't, I just think... I don't think the songs are that good, you know what I mean? And there's just lots of silly... And not even that out there production on it, you know what I mean? And that's not me digging it out. I just think... I think he... Uh, I, like Dead in the Water is a good tune, you know what I mean? I just think, I just don't think it's as good as his first two, you know what I mean? And I don't even think it's that out there, you know what I mean? People, he's going on about what he's on a journey and all that, and it's like, it's not, you know, it sounds fucking, sounds like a shit killer shaker. <laughs> uh, will you be having a, a scissor player? No, God, no. <laughs> No, we've got a potato. No, we got we had the potato peeler, didn't we? At the Bethnal Green gig, but yeah, they've, they've banned, I'm not, not into that nonsense. You know what I mean? They've, they've banned potato peelers at the what is it Park Life Festival? Yeah. <laughs> what do you make of that? I think it's a shame, man. <laughs> um, because because you'd good said for like, good for chopping things out on and all. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Not all about peeling potatoes. Is it? <laughs> But did, did, didn't you have a truce with, with Noel over, over, yeah, over well the Christmas was, that, period? Yeah, well, in my head I did. Well, because it's Christmas, isn't it? I mean, Mum's always going, you know, look, you know, calm down and all that. And I sort of had a couple of drinks and that, and I thought, yeah, I'll just, I'll put it out there. But it's just not happening, is it? But because people were saying that you'd met up at the Chilton Firehouse. No, no, no. That never happened? No, no, no. I went there and he, he wasn't there. Oh shit. He so, wasn't meant to be there either, you know what I mean? But, oh, okay. No, no, no. Well, that's his little hangout, innit? You know what I mean? Right? Oh, and always. he's like, Posh mates go, so I thought I'd steam down there and see what they got to say. Oh, right, okay, so you went sort of on the off chance. Went down there just to see, look for, looking for a bit of trouble and that, you know what I mean? There was none of them about, were really. they? Right. probably at home, <laughs> counting the money. Right, okay. So when you, so when, so this, this sort of supposed truce, was that just something that you were putting out on? Just a black man. Right, okay. Just me drunk. Because <laughs> people got quite excited, people thought, oh, I know, made people up, do, know, don't they? But, you know, so, you know, that's the, and I'm sorry if I'm breaking people's hearts, but it was a, just a little drunkard thing and that's the way it is. You, you should know me by now, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I think people were surprised because people thought that you sort of had made up and then yeah. there was, you'd said stuff and, and he'd said yeah, stuff. Yeah, no, I don't, no, we're not, made, we're not made up. I mean, I've put, I listen, I've told, I've said it in many occasions that I'd love to get Oasis back and love to do all this and like, you know, and blah, blah, blah. And I don't know what I'm apologising for because I've got nothing to apologise. He was the one who split the band up. So, but I've put it out many times that it's all cool around that way. Yeah, I'll have a little pop at him and all that. Because I, I think, you know, he deserves it. And he has pops at me and stuff, you know what I mean? So, I mean, this is sort of like, what, what you're doing now is, is doing amazing the world. The record's gone platinum. Yeah. Um, but would you give it all up to, to go back to Oasis? Oh, no, no, I wouldn't actually. I think we'd have to sit and have a chat about it. I mean, the, th the dynamics of the band, if this hadn't gone well, right, and I'm not saying Noel would have got the band back together and that, but if I'd have been sat at home on my arse, you know what I mean? I'd have been his little bitch, wouldn't I, for the rest of my life, you know what I mean? Oh, I see, right, if okay. The band, if, it would have, if he ever would have come and spared mercy on me, you know what I mean, or pity on me, you right. know what I mean? But yeah, now the yeah. dynamic, now that it has gone well, the dynamics of the band have changed, and I'm sure that's pissed him off as well, you know what I mean? He's probably <laughs> thinking, if he did have a little plan together, I'm sure that's gone out the window now, you know what I mean? Because I've got a bit of kudos, or what is it? What's that thing that people say? I've got a bit of... Oh, cachet. You know, I've got a bit of thing, you know, like it's like so, but I, w I would give it up for Oasis, but I certainly wouldn't give it, it'd have, it'd have to be on both our terms. Yeah, yeah. That's how it should have been, you know what I mean? Yeah. I'm not sitting here to be a sol I'm not sitting here to be a solo dude and that, that's not for me, I'm part of a band, you know what I mean? That's how I feel, you know what I mean? Yeah. But I would, I would give it up if it was, if it was, um, if it was, if it was on the right terms and that's how I think Oasis should be, you know what I mean? Should never have been about, yeah, you wrote the songs, but should never have been about you know him living in live, living different lifestyles than the rest of the band. That that's that's a recipe for disaster, isn't it? Because I think it goes to your head then, and then you start treating it. You start thinking like these are your band. You know what I mean? I'm right. working for him, and that's not the way it is. Do you think any any of the sort of the drive and ambition behind as you were came from wanting to prove yourself to to to, to, to know to change that dynamic? 
no I weren't thinking about him when we were doing a record no I just wanted to get back out there man I wanted to prove to myself my kids my missus my mum my other brother you know the people who, who really matter and obviously you know the fans that have you know been there from beginning you know what I mean I wanted to prove to them that you know it's not our you know all's not lost you know what I mean I still, yeah. I still mean it you know what I mean yeah 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 whether I've got whether I've got an army of songwriters with me or a team of people doing it for me I still fucking mean it, you know what I mean? And I mean it just as much as any of the other clowns that are about these days <laughs> who, who write their own songs. Right, yeah, yeah. 